Okay, today I'll be act reacting to How It's Made Bubblegum. Um, original video being in the description down below. Over a million views. So, yeah. Um, let's get into it. Chewing gum dates back to the ancient like Greeks who chewed like resin that. from trees. Modern chewing gum was patented in the U.S. in 1869 by, believe it or not, a dentist. In 1928, another American invented bubble gum. I don't think they go too hard. Bubble gum comes in gumballs of all colors and sizes. But for blowing bubbles, nothing beats the chewy, gooey pink stuff in the twist wrap. It all starts with the, the gum, gum ball base, machine. the stuff that makes gum chewy. Traditionally, the really base rocks. came from tree resin. Today, it's synthetic, made of plastics and rubbers. They pour the gum base into a mixer, then add color and flavoring. As it begins mixing, they pour in glucose syrup, a sweetener. Because it's liquid, it helps keep the gum base soft. Next, they add dextrose, a powdered sweetener. They blend the ingredients for about 20 minutes. The stirring action builds up heat, which melts everything together. Okay. All this for bubble gum. This is kind of odd in a way. This is on the science show. The mixture's ready when it reaches the consistency of bread dough. They transfer it by cart to a machine called the pre-extruder. The machine squeezes the mixture through a narrow opening, like squeezing toothpaste from the tube. Okay. This transforms the big bulky wad like into thin, manageable strips that can then go through the extruders. Like margin the extruders squeeze each strip down to the actual width of a piece of bubble gum. It comes out as one long, continuous stream to be cut into bite-sized pieces later on. This extrusion process heats up the gum. If they were to cut and wrap it now, it would stick to the wrapper. So the next stop is a cooling chamber. The gum goes in for 15 minutes at temperatures between 37 and 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. When the bubble gum comes out, it's cooled down enough for what they call the cut and wrap. One machine does both jobs in a fraction of a second. Watch the action in slow motion. As the continuous stream of gum enters on one end, the machine cuts it into bite-sized pieces, pushes each piece into a wax paper wrapper, then twists both ends of the wrapper closed. This is super crazy thing. Here's the slow motion replay from a different angle. The machine processes no more pieces of, like, of bubble gum flipping. per minute. Last stop, packaging. The bubble gum moves onto a scale that automatically weighs out the right amount per tub. Okay. Is it right though? They seal the tub with plastic to make it airtight. This keeps the bubble gum fresh. Ever wonder why bubble gum is pink? 
is because that's the only color Walter Deemer had on hand when he invented this tree back in 1928. Since then, the color just stuck. Well, I mean, okay, I guess that was educational. Um, so, yeah. I would watch the money one, but that's 42 minutes, and we're not going to have that on this channel. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, um, link to the video will be in the description down below. And I guess that was like an educational um, video. So, yeah. Um, like, comment, subscribe, share. And honestly, you don't really have to. Well, I mean, you can share if you want to. So, yeah. <laughs> so, peace out.